Welcome to my uh, continuing tutorial on Moodle quizzes. Uh, this uh, tutorial is about the essay exam or essay question and uh, it applies to version 1.9 of Moodle. So what we have to do here is first we log on as teacher and then uh, of course enter our Moodle course and then we look for administration and questions so what we want to do in the question bank is to create a an essay exam or an essay question rather so you go to choose and then select essay and then here we give it a descriptive name so we'll just say essay question okay. now it's good practice when you put the question text to prepare it in advance and I have it here in a text file so I, ga I gave it okay let's copy all you have to do now is copy and uh, paste so here in my essay exam I gave directions and it's about a discussion of writing in world civilization where they will have to consider a number of concepts okay aside from that uh, in my essay exam I'm going to be providing a set of oh rather here a set of rubrics here okay uh, we'll select Oops, I think we'll just select the entire thing. Okay, copy and paste. And you can see the rubrics included to serve as a guide for the student. This rubrics came from the Chicago Board of Education and I'll provide the reference of course. Incidentally that was uh, the the software for the rubrics is open office and then this is simply a text editor where I got my directions. So prepare your essay in advance so that you don't waste uh, internet time when you create your essay exam. So the essay exam is very easy when, uh, in terms of creation. So you just leave all of this uh, as it is. I'll give it a question grade of 100. I'm not going to put in a feedback and I'll just click save changes okay now the next step is go back to your course and then we're going to create the essay quiz activity so go to the right hand corner upper right hand corner of your screen turn editing on and then scroll down and add an activity select quiz so this is the essay quiz itself so I'll entitle it essay quiz production this is oh, say this is an essay quiz period and uh, of course we don't need to shuffle within questions okay we'll leave everything as it is uh, default and then go and save and display now here we have to your right the question bank and to your left is the quiz itself the template 
so what we're going to do is we're going to put our question which is essay question to the left by clicking the chevron okay. and there's our quiz now since our total grade is 100 I'm going to change the maximum grade as well to equate that to 100 and then click save changes and then we can now go and preview our essay quiz and there it is okay we have the directions we have the rubric and below that is a an, a, an editor back an a box an HTML editor box for the input by the student so all the student have to do is type your answer here blah 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 okay and then all he has to do or she has to do is to s submit all and finish now of course we can do that here if uh, we want to be able to test your quiz as a student you may also go to back go back to the uh, course page and then look for the upper right hand corner and you have their switch role too and you can turn yourself temporarily into a student so you can see how it will all look like from a student's perspective without having to create a student account and logging out and logging in and then there's the essay quiz you can test that so uh, this is what the student will see first okay uh, and then you, since I've already done a preview it's already recorded there so I may attempt that and then would say this is my answer and then submit and finish and then it says here um, it want to verify whether you wish to submit you just click OK and this is from the student's perspective uh, again um, so here you give the student is given a uh, review of what they have done because I've set it uh, unlimited meaning the student can do it over and over again but you can always set it once so the answer is reflected here so I'll just click finish review and go back to the uh, course page so to return to the teacher uh, role all I have to do is go back to the upper right hand corner and click return to my normal role okay so uh, as you've noticed uh, in essay exam the quiz itself is not automatically graded so uh, it's manually graded what I'm going to show you next is how to manually grade the quiz so I have prepared one in advance with a uh, student answer so here is where what you will see as a teacher so what you want to do here is to click what is known as the results tab and you can see that it has been reported that there is already one attempt by a student so the student of course is me uh, also as a student my student role there so in order to grade this what we want to do 